Just went four years. Yeah. Four years. Okay. Did you go immediately to medical school? No. Uh, uh, didn't. Um, had a year before I was accepted, and then I went to four years of uh, medical school. Then I did three years of uh, pediatric residency, and then three years of pediatric cardiology fellowship. Where did you go to medical school? Uh, medical College of Georgia. And when did you graduate? Uh, 1982. You mentioned that you did a, I think, a, was it a pediatric residency or a mm -hmm. cardiology residency? Well, well, a residency was general pediatrics. Okay. So I did three years of that at the medical college there. And then um, I was fortunate that uh, they uh, thought enough of me to go ahead and offer me a fellowship in pediatric cardiology there uh, before I'd even I was halfway through my second year of residency, so I stayed and uh, I did three years there our in, in witness, fellowship. <laughs> our last witness, uh, Dr. Puente, explained to us what a medical residency is, mm -hmm. uh, but I don't think we've heard what a fellowship is after residency. Can you tell us what a fellowship is? Mm -hmm. Well, um, in, in a, well, a residency, you sort of do, do a lot of different but when you do a fellowship, you're specifically focused on one particular subspecialty. Uh, in my case, it was pediatric cardiology. Is it fair to say that in your, in your residency, you gain your specialty, but in your fellowship, you get a subspecialty? That's correct. Okay. Uh, when did you finish your, your pediatric cardiology fellowship? 1988. Oh, that's when I graduated high school in 1988. Oh. Yes, sir. Tell us where you worked as a pediatric cardiologist. Well, uh, initially, I uh, was employed, if you will, by Memorial Medical Center uh, starting July 1988. And 